to Gems with Moon Sparkle. Today we will be discussing my friend the Red Jasper. But before I start, just let me state anything that resonates with you, you are welcome to take. And anything that doesn't resonate with you, please leave here. Where do I start? The Red Jasper. So I just want to say that the Red Jasper is a part of my crystal healing toolkit. The red jasper can be found in places like Brazil or India. I found my red jasper in the Cave of Wonders here in San Diego. I haven't been to like many, many crystal stores. I would say five and I think I'm over exaggerating with that. But the Cave of Wonders is truly a gem. I will leave the address location of the Cave of Wonders in the description below. But I love the Cave of Wonders. If you are crystal shopping or gym shopping on a budget, that is the place to go. I just want to say um, the owner, he has transitioned into light, but you can feel his energy there and it is amazing. I love getting my crystals or gems from the Cave of Wonders. So that's where I found this gem. One thing about um, me when I am gym shopping I receive gems in whichever way, shape, or form they come, meaning they don't have to be polished. I actually like them when they're a little raw. For me, that's just my preference. But once again, I'm open to receiving gems in any way, shape, or form that they may come. If your astrological sign is Taurus or Aries, the red jasper is good for you. But once again, it is good for any astrological sign. The red jasper is connected to your root chakra. I will not go into detail on this series about chakras. I plan on doing another series on the different chakras. But just for your information, um, the red jasper is connected to your root chakra. The purpose of this series is to talk about the healing qualities of gems. So with that being said, I just want to share some healing qualities of the red jasper. The red jasper aids in rebirth. When I am say rebirth, I'm speaking of the death of anything and the rebirth of that. So for me, I got the red jasper. Um, I experienced a friend once told me a personal death. So I lost my aunt. And it's, this was also around the time of my spiritual awakening. And so I found that the red jasper really supported me during the time of her transition. I was also going through a breakup and I found that the red jasper supported me in the transition of that breakup. I was also going through the process of building my relationships with my adult children. And I found that the red jasper supported me in that. The red jasper has supported me in my healing process um, when I was doing healing work. What I like to do with my crystals or my gems when I first get them is spend time with them. They are truly your friends. You can even name them if you like. Me, this is just the red jasper. I spend time sleeping with them. I spend time um, taking them wherever I may go. So if I go to work, they come with me. They go to my car with me, they shower with me. I spend time programming my crystals to whatever music that I want to store inside of this crystal. Because this crystal is connected to the root chakra, it is good for strengthening your survival instincts. So I tend to focus on my foundation and my grounding when I'm with this crystal. Um, during the time I got this crystal, I was going to the park every day. So this crystal got to hang out in different grass locations in different parts of California. This crystal um, went on many, many hikes with me. So I really, really was programming this crystal for grounding. A lot of times uh, with this crystal, because it is good for the root chakra, I would keep it on the lower half of my body. So like in my pocket, or um, you can use surgical tape and tape it to like your root chakra. I often meditated this crystal. The red jasper is good for meditation. It is good for extreme meditation. The red jasper is good for if you are suffering from anxiety, stress, or worry. 
the red jasper will relax you. What I also like about the red jasper is it is good for dream recall. So if you have been watching my channel, you may know that I am into logging my dreams. So this dream, I mean, this gym has supported me in dream recall. One thing that I find in interesting about getting to know my crystals is I do tend to interact with them more um, in my dream state. So I notice different dreams when I interact with my crystals. This crystal, or this gem, is also good for astral travel. I am not well versed in the knowledge of astral travel. I feel like I have experienced it, but I don't really want to speak on it too much until I obtain more knowledge on astral travel. This gem is an amazing gem to add to your toolkit. want to honor this gym. For physical benefits, pretty much prevents illness is what it's said to be. This gym is really, really good, as I was stating before, for rebirth. So this is a good gym for um, a fresh start or new beginnings or new opportunities. I really enjoy. Let me just show you my, my baby one more time. I feel a lot of masculine energy from this red jasper. Once again, you know, I use crystals or gems for healing tools. I wouldn't say that this crystal should go before a doctor or anything like that. It's up to you. For me, I do fool with my crystals before going to see a doctor. Like if something's going on with me, I go to my crystals first. But I am not encouraging you to do that. I think that you, you should follow your own belief system. But as for me, I truly believe in my crystals. I want to thank you for joining me in talking about Red Jasper. Thank you for joining me today on Gems with Moon Sparkle. I look forward to sharing more gems with you. If you want to share any information about Red Jasper and how you move with the Red Jasper, I encourage you to leave comments below so that we can interact. If you like what you see, click like. And if you would like to subscribe, click subscribe, but I really want to thank you for joining me in Gems with Moon Sparkle.